Hi friends, RBI extended. RBI Governor Shaktikan Das announced three-month moratorium on all loans, including credit card, during the you know towards the end of March, and it was for it was for March, April, and May. And most of us availed that facility as well. Though I was cautioning all of you that you should not be availing this facility since the interest will continue to accrue. There, it's not an interest holiday, or it is not a you know EMI waiver. It was just a EMI moratorium, which means whatever the EMI you will not pay now, you will have to pay towards the end with interest. Which means if you now take moratorium on. Three EMIs, you will end up with paying literally eight, nine EMIs if you have a loan tenure of 15, 20 years. So I was cautioning everyone not to avail. But now there is a discussion going on. I was going through a Financial Express report which says Indian Banks Association has suggested RBI to extend loan moratorium for a period of three months more. What does it mean? Why are they doing it? Why banks are requesting? RBI to extend loan moratorium. What is the gain for banks? I will tell you the complete details. Not just that, I will also tell you whether you should avail this facility or not. Before that, in case if you have not yet subscribed to our YouTube channel, please subscribe now and also hit the bell icon to enable notifications. Plus, please share this video with your friends and family. So RBI announced loan moratorium towards the end of March because people were in deep crisis they had lost their jobs they had lost income and and they were locked down they were locked down they locked inside their homes they didn't have any other source to pay back their loan emis but now why are they trying to extend loan emi again because government has only announced lockdown till may 16th it may not be there after that but the reality is considering the current numbers the lockdown may continue even beyond June, July, which means we may not be able to earn till June or July. If this continues, the situation will be worse. Even if the lockdown ends by end of May, people may not be able to get back to their jobs immediately because there may not be any jobs. Hence, banks are worried. Why banks are worried? Banks are worried because if RBI doesn't extend the moratorium, the people will not be able to pay back their EMIs. Why people? When people don't pay EMIs for a period of three months, our banks will have to classify those loans as NPAs, non-performing assets. Once they start classifying all these, you know, all these pending accounts as NPAs then their NPA book will grow which means their profits will go down eventually and their share price will go down which is going to hit them badly. That's why they want to keep their books clean at least the window dressing they want to do because these are all eventual NPAs, eventual defaults which is going to happen they are aware of it they just want to push it as much as possible because as per the recent in a quarterly results announced by most of the banks they have already created a provision for covid-19 you know defaults which means they are expecting that their npa book may grow by 1% 2% 3% some banks have even provisioned for 4 5% which means now the npas will grow that's why banks want to take the shield from rbi of extending the moratorium for three more months which means for the next three months, they will kind of get a shield. They don't have to reclassify the assets. That's one part. The second part here is banks are also thinking about increasing their income because when the when there is moratorium, they will not be. They don't really have to reclassify the assets. They don't have to classify them as NPA, which means they will have. You know their income being accrued at least on the books which means I have given out a lakh crore lakh crore of loans you know one lakh crore loans and now now on that if the interest let's say per month interest is one percent one lakh crore loan if I have given out one thousand crore of interest you know I will be able to accumulate at least accrue on my books every month so which means my income will only grow so i don't really have to worry about my income it is just that 
the collection will get delayed collection will get delayed means there is a potential loss in collection potential increase in the NPA that's what we need to really worry and that's why banks are trying to safeguard their interest by creating provision I really don't know how long that will suffice because the current situation is bad so now if you ask me should you avail this facility my suggestion as much as possible please avoid it Away, availing moratorium is a bad idea because even during the moratorium period your interest will accrue especially on your credit cards please 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 don't avail moratorium on your credit cards because credit card companies and banks will charge you anywhere between three and half to five percent interest on your credit card outstanding amount if you avail the moratorium also this three and half to five percent interest will continue to accrue every month so please be very cautious please don't avail in case if you're in a worse condition avail moratorium on your home loan personal loan and other loans but not credit card debt in case if you have credit card debt please borrow from somewhere and avail it in fact in financial freedom workshop financial freedom app as well i've spoken about various ways to come out of debt trap in case if you have debt you can learn hundreds of ways to come out of your debt trap in financial freedom app in case if you have not downloaded the app Please download now. I've given the link to both Android and iOS app in the description box. And once you download Financial Freedom app, you will get to learn how to become rich. You will get to learn the secrets to become rich. Not just that, you also have an opportunity to become a Financial Freedom Ambassador and start earning from home. I'll be back with another video soon. Thanks for watching. Be wise, get rich.